Good evening folks, welcome to our Friday evening stream of Two Point Hospital. We are continuing our Duckworth Upon Bulls mission, which is the red tape, red tape, red tape bureaucratic mission where we can't charge for our services because we are doing the county a favor uh, and running a public hospital. Um, so we have to meet targets to, uh, set, set by the health ministry to uh, get any money. Also, uh, let me just double check my sound is working before I start What running. would Two Point County do without the masses of tourists and oh, the lots of new hospitals as well? It's well, got the one star. Your resort Crockle Bay would be out of business for one thing. And so would all the hospitals that specialize in exotic diseases. I guess what I'm saying is, we should thank visitors for bringing their viruses in from all over the world. <laughs> Anyone who has spent time on a hot, sticky, uncomfortable beach knows what to expect of a place like Sweaty Palms. But this seaside resort has the added frisson of being in the shadow of spluttering Nora, a dormant but nonetheless menacing volcano, and suffering from frequent earthquakes. In short, I suggest you construct your puny little sandcastles elsewhere. And good morning to Pebbly Reef, where everyone should just be waking up in Two Points' very own paradise. Oh, no. I'm being told that the entire county has the same time zone. Alright then. Good afternoon, Pebbly Reef. <laughs> uh, moving on. I overheard a couple planning an upcoming visit to Goldpan the other day. Why should the youth of our county feel compelled to spend their leisure time visiting a glorified petrol station? Economic hardship or sheer stupidity? Call in to cast your vote. I think a UFA one, I think. Oh, so many new missions! What was that? Okay, Giles, take a letter. Are you listening? Because I'm about to start talking. Giles, Giles, okay, good. Greetings, find out their name. I hope you're well, etc, etc. My interest is residing in the iconic immortality granting spring that's said to inhabit Pebbly Island. My research has identified three probable locations on the island. My chief concern is that the island is filled with all manner of diseases, most of which aren't found on the mainland. You have been chosen to sterilize our path to the spring with some of your rather splendid hospitals. In return, I offer you glory in your field. Be a part of the greatest breakthrough in history of healthcare. Indeed, it's very in point. Oh, and I'll pay for your trip. We start our search in Pebbly Reef and sign off whatever makes sense. Now, what's for lunch? Giles, Giles, why are you still writing? Giles, Giles! Wiggy Silverbottom. <laughs> Silverbottom. And two point squabbler. <laughs> Greetings, puny administrator. It is I, investigative journaliz journalizer, charlatine, fish rapper of the Two Point Squabbler. I am conducting a secret reporting espionage, and conducting secret reporting espionage, and I have achieved clearance for you to help. Reporting espionage. The government are hide and sneaking a space crash and keeping super quiet, even though there is lots of health problems in the town. In the to the area and its town people. You must cure them and prevent end of times. To receive clearer, more see-through above clearance for me to write all about government secrecies and find the ongoing going on. Transmission over. Char Charlatine a fish wrap. Okay. So I'm still waiting for these ones. I thought these were the ones which was going to be unlocked. But... This one? This one has now disappeared. There used to be a mission over there. Maybe it unlocks later. Once we've done the first UFO mission. This is still there, which is the... Um, the Pointy Mountains Bigfoot Expansion. Or DLC. And... I think these are Mainland or Regular Quest, Crockle Bay and Sweaty Palms. And... Pebbly and Pebbly All in the DLC stuff and this is the UFO DLC one. Gold pan and these two 
get a starting gold fan. Chasm 24, get a starting camouflage force. Okay, so now we know roughly how much more missions there are. I don't know if there's stuff going that side as well. Yeah, so I think the... I did have a look at the Steam achievement. The highest achievement that the fewest people got is 72 stars achievement, which is, I think, just getting 3 stars in all the available hospital missions. Which means there's 23 missions and we are in the ninth mission. <laughs> so we've got a fair bit to go. Let's keep going. <laughs> The marathon, not a sprint. Duckworth upon a bilge. Public target. Unblock eight toilets. Promote a staff. Nurse, Nurse to the pharmacy. Also. There's two of them. Two of them. Ah, oh, not quick enough. So they require some patient uh, Perfect. We cured the entire group of patients. This has really helped our reputation and we've been sent a big reward. 15 rep, 15 kudos and $20,000. This was the injection room mood poisoning. It's easy to say it's good because it's an easy disease. Illness difficulty is only 30%. Great. Uh, hmm. Surgery required. Sorry, not yet. Uh, let me make sure all my stuff gets fixed. Need a janitor. Yeah, I think I went a bit wild in the hiring the last few staff members. We need to meet more of our targets. Get funding. Ah, repair, please. Repair. Must, must repair. Oh, look at this. Very, very red toilet. It's very much unblocking. <laughs> of my janitors are in there. Probably why we are struggling a bit. Nurse required in general diagnosis. Uh, janitor. Stop that smoking please. Staff morale is only 69%. I'll we'll have a look at that again if we reach our cured 100 patients milestone. Staff promotion. A bell roadkill is ready for promotion from junior assistant to assistant. Yay! Promotion for the public target. $50,000 coming up. There we go. Uh, a patient with heart throb is seeking treatment. Required is surgery. It will cost $26,000 to build. What would you like to do? Same patient. Sorry. Staff a promotion. Janitor to senior janitor as well. Promote. Training course complete. Maintenance. Team. Okay. So, uh, trainees. I want more uh, GP stuff. So this guy and this guy. Can be trained in GP one. It's a bit tight though. The only problem with uh, such tight um, staffing policies that I've got, um, I just want to have exactly the right amount of people. <laughs> that if we take two people, three people out of circulation to train them. Or GPs especially. So they're just gonna go mad everywhere else. And we're still getting lots of patients that we don't even end up curing or trying to treat. Because uh, we don't want to build the facilities. 
70,000 revenue. Staff challenge from David Fudge. I don't know about you, but I find the relentless stream of death somewhat depressing. Do you think we'd go a few months without any fatalities? We can try. Let's try not to kill anyone. Also, we have a quick look at uh, patients. Back to ward. Illness difficulty 80%. Oh, it's the shattered one. Man, that's that one is a tough one. Okay. Uh other GP stuff that we can hurry people along. Not this guy. Yeah. Hurry him along. Same for treatment. Surgery, same patient there. Uh same patient there. That one I know is Turtle Head, which requires a head office, which we haven't got. So uh very rampant. Surgery. No. So, sorry. Uh, you have to go to a specialist area. Or a specialist hospital that is not ours. Psychiatry. Uh, how about you? Ah, injection. Okay. And be right. Appointment in cardiology. Mm. Okay. What do we have? Staff promotion. A Bertie Burp. <laughs> ready for promotion from nurse to senior nurse. Okay. Promote. Listen up, people. We're in danger of being overrun by corporate interests. There'll be a protest outside of Jumbo headquarters in Krakenbush. You'll find me picketing there. So come Surgery. join us. Patient. In the meantime, uh, generate two hundred three sponsor Jumbo okay. Nuts would like to remind you just how tasty Lord Fox Reese has contacted us with details of our latest targets. Research for this. Okay. Senators, please fix everything. Especially the toilet. The, to the toilet, please. Also, now that we've trained that Janet, that's right. So we've got upgrade janitors and we've got two. It's got a maintenance. I think I'm gonna start doing this. Uh, they not allowed to these two. Not allowed to repair machines, but the others can. So I will take these two off of watering duty. <laughs> Um, and we talking to you well. so you could give them a bit more free time to actually do repairs. And these guys can do the upgrades when they do upgrades. On a break though. <laughs> on a break okay need to mayonnaise okay we've had 18 days without a death so far maintenance announcement automated snack machines need restocking manually
Hey, hard drive has been repaired. Coming to the reception, Clementine style. Clementine style. Seven patients. What? Okay, there we go. Servicing at reception. Yeah, we've got two locations currently use assistance. Maintenance announcement. Oh, my bad. Need water. We went 35 days without a death. Sorry. <sighs> oh, saw someone died. Ghost? Yeah, we've got a ghost. Okay. Um, let's see. A ghost capturing Jennifer. Luna. Please come and capture the ghost. Oh. It scares the patient. <laughs> doo -doo 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 -doo. Upgrade the heart racer. Not now. I want rewards for upgrading stuff. For the moment our expenses are 50,000 a month. So we definitely need our uh, We definitely need our um one more GP trained. Maintenance announcement. Toilets need routine service. And another GP train. Sweet. Failed to cure him of a night fever. It's the one with too many mirror balls. <laughs> Sweet. We've got more uh, GPs back in circulation. Got this one. Denim jeans. Oof. This is the one that's got, um, we've got one doctor that can work there. So the doctor with genetics can only work in uh, research or genetics. Um, hmm. How much time have we got to put the doctor? So we not goop. <gasps> Two Point County Healthcare Award Ceremony! It's one of our big money makers. Let's see how we do. Rising star of the year goes to... Leo... Fenderson of Sports Hospitals Foundation. Employer of the Year goes to Duckworth upon Bulls of Sports Hospitals Foundation. No death goes to Bungle Meditech. <laughs> Best Teaching Hospital goes to Duckworth upon Bulls. Patient's Choice Award goes to Holistic. Most prestigious hospital goes to Duck with the Bundle. Best Research Hospital goes to Duck with the Bundles again. Ooh. Hospital of the Year goes to. Dunk with a bumble! Six times five, thirty thousand dollars. Not bad, not bad. Check out leaderboards. So, our hospital value, I think, has gone down. 
Mm, yeah, I think because we, we're spending more on wages, our expenses isn't that much lower than our uh, incoming yearly profits. Yeah, I think last year we had the 300,000 profit. We've got more cures though. <laughs> 41. Cure rate is 43. What? Uh, reputation is very high though, 98%. And staff morale is 70 there's a queue outside of a GP's office. Do you think it's worth building another one? Uh, we've met our target. That was the research. Which I think means... What I'm gonna do is train one of our researchers. Ian Riddle in Research 2, if we can. Research 2. Which we need a special trainer for. We will start training him so he can get more research is done. There's my moles, okay. Let's do Dr. Finish it. Arena Goop. No, not working in research. You are coming here. ASAP. Because there are patients that urgently need DNA lab. 10MG, like this patient. Uh, new talks. Cure three patients in pharmacy. $100,000! So, just play the game, just play the game. It should be alright. Come on in, come on in. More targets. Upgrade a machine. Ooh, now the big one is... Mm. Easy scan is already easy scan three in that room. What we can do is upgrade this one. Yeah. <clears throat> See if we can help this guy before he dies, please, please. I might turn this machine sideways. Or just around so the patient only has to walk there. Cured? Yes! Sweet. Like this guy. Health low. Diagnosis almost done. The feeling we're gonna send this like guy home. Just want to make sure we do it before he dies. <laughs> Jasmine Odyssey is diagnosis with a number one album. Plumps DNA lab. Salivation. Okay. Includes the Might be alright. If our doctor hasn't left. Oh, where's the doctor going? So we don't go up and no. We don't go to research, please. We need a patient. Cure and patient urgently. And no one He's on his way. Okay. Eight bitten. Season failed. And now Google we've got a Music. bunch of. This is the problem of getting your reputation so high. <laughs> if everybody comes to your hospital, your cues go mad. I wonder what this new illness discovered. Plumps. A most unfortunate genetic condition. Although the flumps can be removed, they frequently grow back. Gen genetic recombobulation. Recombobulation is usually the only option. Okay. The flumps. And I think we might also need. A bit of space because our cues are going. Bonkers! GP skis might build more GPs just like a GP wing. <laughs> Which might actually be not a bad idea actually. Because then we've got two wings on the side which can be diagnosis rooms. Then you come back to the GP's wing and they send you to the treatment rooms. Not there, not there. So we've got GPs and diagnosis wings. 
upgrade a machine. Pythus Mosh. Check out. Uh, it's not the best one to upgrade stuff. Circus Incident! Um, a number of clowns have run away from a traveling circus and are looking for treatment to stop being so silly. We'll be rewarded if we treat this group. Should we have them sent here? Cure seven patients with chest infection. Treatment room, clown clinic, of which we have one in the hospital. Time limit 90 days, 10 rep, 10 kudos, and 10 dollars. See, can we get a smoke treatment over there? It's gonna be tight. Just gonna repair that before the clowns start arriving. And see if I can uh, move one of our super treatment nurses. Still has lots of energy, which is uh, so close. The superstar. Um gonna move her. I think she's allowed to work in the Thumb clinic because that's the treatment room. Just make doubly sure. Anika Thump can work <coughs> in the clown clinic. Doctor to psychiatry, please. Pest control. There's the queue for pest control then. Ah, over there. Way over there. Okay, uh, let me have a quick look at our repair a thon. Janitors are failing it. Come on, janitors. You know, there's a lot to do in this hospital, and there's only four of you. But please, please work very hard. Please work very hard. We need everything to work. Super well, super well. Yuka plants are about to die. We stock of vending machines. We stock of vending machine. Maybe I need to get another janitor. Let me have a quick look at the higher menu for janitors. Hmm. Ghost capture, maintenance, and speed. This might be a good one. Positive believes a moldy pen is toxic. Okay. More janitors. Repair. Where's this patient going? He's dying. The patient that is dying, please respond to the call. Where are you going? Cardiology. Send for treatment. Uh, new illness, leprosy skin discovered. A skin abnormality that has become quite fashionable in recent years. This mutation originated in the labs at Grockle Bay Zoo after scientists attempted to create a human cat hybrid. Same incident that led to the related condition, a lion head. Send the patient for treatment in our DNA lab. Okay, just check. Okay, our doctor's still there, so we don't have to call him there for emergency. Ah, great. So just before the clowns are arriving, which they are any moment now. Where are the clowns? Are they here already? It's a quick for clowns. No? Um, I'm just happy that the janitor got there before. Did I not? Yeah, it's a weird. This queuing system stops them halfway. Current staff morale 76%. Quite a few of our staff have pre-training slots 
maximize their potential by training them in a training room surgery. Some patient. Sorry. Uh, 